Hey everyone, Emma here. I hope you're well. Um, I'm making a little video because I am very excited. For those that um, know me will already know that I actually enjoy designing paper cut designs based on my faith as a Christian. And um, those that don't, obviously, um, a paper cut design is um, something I enjoy creating and obviously framing up, making cards with, making tippings with and stuff like that. Um, the designs are cut, hand cut from a single sheet of paper using a craft knife which you can buy in um, any craft store, um, Amazon, um, places like that. Um, and I'm very excited because um, for a while I have wanted to um, get around to creating my um, designs I make into templates um, which will be added to my Etsy shop. People can obviously buy and download to their computer and enjoy printing off and cutting themselves. Um, so obviously I'm making a little video for those who might not be too sure what to do um, if they thought oh I wouldn't mind giving that a try. Um, so basically what you would do is obviously purchase the template and download it from Etsy to your computer and um, when you, it would come as a PDF file and as you obviously load it up there are some instructions in the PDF file um, but obviously when you print it off this is what it would look like and um, as you can see um, I haven't printed off the first page that's got a bit more instructions on um, there's some little instructions on it here to tell you that you would actually cut these grey areas out. Um, so I will get round to that a bit more in a minute. But um, when you come to print your template, um, you can choose to print it um, on thin white card. So you can um, create it in white and enjoy sticking it on a nice different coloured backing. Um, obviously point be noted make sure it is thin card because if it's too thick it is quite you know not nice to cut out um, or you can enjoy I also enjoy buying different colored paper to cut my designs out on um, but um, obviously the back side of the paper is actually white so I would obviously make sure I load it into my printer so the template design is printed onto the white side so then when I cut it out and flip it over the words would be the right way round on say this blue sheet of paper so like you can buy any colours you like I've got gold I mean this is a nice shimmery white um, so and then obviously black um, but I tend to like cutting out a thin white card that is my go-to thing I cut out of. So um, for this video I have just printed onto a thin sheet of A4 paper because obviously I don't want to waste um, card. Um, so what you do is obviously um, I will quickly show you once you have printed the template design off onto the piece of paper you want. Obviously it's a good idea to have a craft mat and um, so you don't cut through any of your surfaces or anything like that and as I say you just use a craft knife which you can buy from um, any craft store or Amazon somewhere like that um, I think mine is off Amazon and um, just to show you you can buy replacement blades for them too so if I just take it out this is just a blade that's in there so obviously be very careful because they are very sharp um, I have obviously said in one video before I've had to have stitches from where I've cut myself. So what you would do then, so for those that may be interested in having a try is, obviously this is a template print off for the design that I've just shown you. So you get the words obviously in grey and then which are flipped back to front because obviously as I said when you turn them over 
they'll be the right way round for you to stick down um, obviously underneath you've got the little bit you can cut out and stick down so that is the right way round and um, so what you would do I'm not going to cut it fully because obviously it does take a while so the idea is obviously you'd print this off and then you would simply cut around the grey areas like so as you can see I will just do one little section to show you like this so what I was just going to do is I will just do this little bit and take that little bit off so you'll get an idea so as you can see so what you would do is you would cut all around the grey bits and then eventually you would be left with just the the words and then obviously um, you can enjoy backing it onto some pretty coloured paper um, and framing it and putting it up in your home or giving it as a gift to a friend. Um, you can enjoy making say a Christmas card with this design. Um, I'm going to, you know, or you can even add this design as a tipping into your Bible, something like that. Um, so hopefully this gives you an idea of what to do with a paper cut template and how to use them um, if you decided to buy them. Um, this is going to be my first one to go on and I will be adding many more and obviously not all of them will be Christmas themed there will be some <laughs> normal themed stuff too um, so anyway hopefully you found this video useful and uh, take care God bless bye